Japan is set for a new prime minister, with Yoshihide Suga saying that he will not run for re-election as leader of the Liberal Democratic Party. His decision paves the way for a new PM after just one year in office. Mr Suga says that he wants to focus instead on fighting the pandemic. Michio Ishida with this report. Prime Minister Yoshida Suga has been signaling from time to time his plan to eventually announce his candidacy in the Liberal Democratic Party presidential race. Mr. Suga took over the remaining term of his predecessor Shinzo Abe a year ago, set to end this 30th of September. But he made the unexpected decision he is not running in the race. In a short doorstop with reporters, he said it's his responsibility as the prime minister to protect the lives and the interests of his people. If he runs in the LDP election, he will not be able to give his utmost to deal with COVID-19. ロリスはできない。now, his approval rating by media polls is mostly below 30 percent. Many are unhappy with the slow handling of COVID-19, with daily cases huge and reports of patients rejected by overwhelmed hospitals. He had to call for a snap election by October as prime minister, but there was growing skepticism among his party members on whether the LDP can win seats under an unpopular leader. The LDP is basically made up of seven major factions. The biggest is led by Shinzo Abe, followed by a faction led by Deputy Prime Minister Taro Aso. Last year, when Mr. Suga ran in the race, most factions were behind him, but this time only two smaller factions expressed their support. He was expected to reshuffle top party posts and the cabinet next week to appoint some of the most popular lawmakers, but he seems to have failed. Mr. Suga wants to call a news conference next week. But all eyes are now on who, besides former Foreign Minister Fumio Kishida, will run in the LDP presidential race. Michio Ishida, CNA, Tokyo.